Yeah, I think now everybody was happy that the league finally started also after 11 weeks. Train, only training uh, was not so easy also from the mental side for the player, for every player and every team here in this league. And uh, nobody know in which condition you are because the guys, they had not really games, only some friendly games and training session. And so I'm very happy about the performance from the guys because uh, I think we deserved the, 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 the winning game and uh, uh, the 1-0. I think from the first minute you could see the first half we played always in the box of the opponent but we forget to score and uh, it was very difficult also to play to, to the guys they told me the pitch was very soft first half was okay second half very very soft uh, my player they had a lot of cramps uh, muscle problems also I think also the opponent you could see, you could see, it was very difficult. The whole day was raining today, and uh, yeah, like in all the games before, uh, we can close the game before, so we can make the second goal and maybe the first goal. But so this is the style in this league, one zero. I would be happy when we can earlier close the game. But important is the mentality. Um, from the tactical side, the guys, they gave everything happy also for Fierza. He scored the first time with the right foot also and uh, good action. Uh, it's also good for him because he make a lot of kilometers on the left side. So I'm happy for him also. And it's very important because we are now two and a half weeks here in the hotels. And the mood from the player when you win a football game it's very important because the whole group is together. So that's why it was good that we had a success start. And yeah, so happy that everybody is okay. And I think it was okay. It was a good, good, good game for the start. <laughs> Alhamdulillah saya sangat senang untuk cetak gol tadi dan saya sangat respect dengan tim Borneo yang sudah bermain baik dan bagus sepanjang pertandingan dan ya gol ini karena tadi adalah gol beruntun karena bukan kaki utama saya ya alhamdulillah kami diberikan kemenangan dan bermain bagus. Baru selanjutnya ada yang mau bertanya. Today, today, um, yeah, this is uh, tactical things in the in the in the game because. Sometimes, um, yeah, we have some ideas also um, what is the best, maybe for the second half, that, that's why we changed also. Uh, Rio came also uh, inside, Rico on the side and uh, yeah, was a good decision because uh, we scored um, a goal. We were also more, more offense in this moment because Rico played on the right side and um, and we had your yeah, only Borneo, they were only dangerous because of, of the contest situation. So it was good that Rio uh, is a fast guy. We put him in the right position and it uh, yeah, was okay. And then, of course, we had a lot of problems. You know, when you watch the game, I don't know, maybe you watch the game also and you don't listen only to what I told outside in the, in the stadium. You could see also that Hamra was injured. We had a lot of Reski was injured, so we had a lot of changes. And then, of course, the player, we have not so many uh, options. Of course, the player uh, is, is, is ready also to play again in a different position. Not a problem, you know. A coach makes always everything right when you play zero behind. 
you know, we didn't receive a goal, everything was good. And, you know, when I am outside, I am football coach and I am with emotion because we play, we train every day hard, very hard. And my guys, they know me already. You know, this is not uh, shouting against somebody. This is about a situation when we can play better out. This is never against the player, the person, or against somebody. This is about the situation that we can do this better. And um, yeah, until I have this fire inside, I want to be coach. When I don't have this fire more, then maybe I will be a journalist. I don't know, or sitting in the tribune. <laughs> okay, tell you what I see. pemain anda yang gol oleh Lili Pali, harus dari oleh Diego Bissel itu uh, bagaimana tanggapan anda uh, sebagai seorang pelatih? Ah, oh, okay, but I, I, I couldn't see this. I don't know. Maybe you, you saw better in the tribune. I couldn't see this. I, I saw only a lot of player, and from one moment of the other moment, I couldn't see this really. So I hear only that he get a kick also two times. Uh, so I don't know. I cannot say nothing. But the referee was in the near. He gave a red card, and I think be later was again a kick. Uh, I don't know what's happened really. So, but of course he has to go. Up. Red card is, I think, is normal, and and was not a good reaction also later. Uh, sure, because we are happy that we can play finally football. So football has emotion, but this is not good to see this kind of things on the pitch. We have also childs in front of the television. So, and uh, yeah. I don't know. No problem. It's not my problem and not my player. Okay. 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 I don't speak more about this because no. You have to go to Bali to speak with the national coach, not with me. I don't know. It's not in my hands. So I cannot say nothing. No. Everybody know it's a strange situation because the players are not here. It's more important that they have training session and they are not... They didn't play the game now for, I don't know, more than two months. Now they have training session there in Bali. And of course every team is the national player. Sure. But it's not correct because it's not a FIFA day. And uh, also for the player not, because they would be happy also to be here with the team. And um, yeah, but when you give one person this kind of power, yeah, I cannot say more, but I think every coach is angry about the situation because nobody spoke with club coaches, nobody. They do what they want, they took the player, nobody communication. So for me, it's a new experience, but I don't like this experience because I'm coming from a different working together. Uh, I was play, I was coach in a lot of countries in Germany. You have a, you work together, not against. So you cannot do what you want. And this is my feeling here. And when everybody accepts this, okay, because I. I am a guest here in Indonesia, but I can say my opinion, but not more. And uh, I'm not happy about the situation. So you have to, to ask him why he do this, because maybe he has the World Championship in front of the door. And um, yeah, so this is for me strange, and for me it's uh, yeah, it's not a good situation because this will be not finished. Now we speak about December, but well, what's happened in January, and February, and March? They are never with us. Same as with under 20 players. They are every, every, every time they are away. Two months they were away now. In Turkey, in Spain, they came back. They are tired. They are tired, the guys. Mental, tired. They risk to get injured. So they come back to Persica. 
we train, we bring them in a good, good, good uh, shape, and they go again two months away. So this is the this is the football in Indonesia, because the league, you know, the league is is, my feeling is not important for them. You know, the support that they want to see the best team on the pitch, and when three or four national player when they miss, it's not the same. So I think it's not correct, and. Um, Maybe other coaches, they, they never say something. Maybe they speak uh, behind the walls. I hear also some coaches, they are not happy with this situation. And I don't know why nobody make pressure or something like this. So, because in every European country and also in South America and other countries, when a league start, every player is there. Huh? Don't uh, misunderstand me because I am happy when the player they are going to the national team because I am happy Hansamu after a long time he's back. Abimano is in the good shape. Ferrari, our young player, he, he never played one game last season. Maybe the next is Fierza or Reski or somebody. But think about maybe we have five players or six national players. Everybody is away and I have to play six games in every three or four days, I think. So, this is, is not correct. And, uh, but we have to do this. And uh, that's why I am happy how the team is together. And, uh, yeah. and I am now six months here. I never had contact with the national coach. Never one time. I'm 56 years old. I played 50 games in the national team. I'm, I'm coach since 20 years. This is the first time in my life that I have no communication with somebody. We never get results. Never get results about training session. Never. We don't know in which condition the player come back. So it's like, uh, I don't know. I, I work different. And now I spoke a little bit more because now you don't must go to Bali also to ask somebody. Okay.